Hey y'all, welcome back to the GG Outdoors channel. Today's video, this is uh, the ammo outline number five, and I'm gonna do a review on the Remington 20 gauge slugger rifle slugs, okay guys? Now I have a love-hate relationship with the Remington sluggers. Um, I have a Remington A7 Express Magnum 20 gauge. I did a review on it, so if you guys search back through my videos, you guys will find that review where I actually you know, shot some of these here. Um, but this is, again is a 20 gauge, 2 and 3 fourths inches, 5 eighths ounce. I do not know the velocity on here, it does not say. Um, the reason I have a love-hate relationship with these Remington Sluggers in 20 gauge is because they didn't perform the best out of my Remington 870, okay? Um, and um, they cost me a few deer. Uh, miss, I missed deer at 40 yards, uh, just wide open, don't know why shot under it um target practice with these but when i bought these i bought a, a 15 round or 20 round value pack at walmart uh not last year but the year before for deer season because that's all that walmart had and i used what i could get and now i would pick these up anytime um because you know with ammo being so hard to find then and i need rifled slugs and I, you know i would shoot these but uh the cool thing about this box, okay, is it actually shows you the choke and um, trajectory data. Rifled slugs may be fired through any choke, but improved cylinder is the best. Okay, on my Remington A70, they, they come with a modified screw-in choke. That's what I shot these things through. Now, maybe if I had changed out the choke to an improved cylinder, I may have done better, but... You know, I didn't know any better about chokes, and now I'm learning. But it tells you guys the trajectory about how they perform at different yardages. So uh, at 25 yards, you know, it's, it shows you how it's going to drop between, um, you know, 0 to 5, I guess. I, I don't really know how to read this chart, but it's right here. Okay, it tells you if that's yards or inches. But uh, that's one neat thing. It's going to tell you how it's going to drop per, per, uh, at the amount of yardage. Um, so these things are pretty neat. Um, the, one of the, eventually, because I'm going to go through each brand of uh, shot shell that I have, even some 22. I'll eventually get into the 22s and break up the shotgun uh, monotony. But uh, this is what these look like. Okay, right here. It's got a hollow point in it. Um, but the the um, shells that my 870 really really liked were the Winchester Super X 20 gauge uh, rifled slugs, and I even had some Federal ones. Those will be videos, you know, um, at a later date. Um, but yeah, I've got a love hate relationship. The reason I bought these, they were the cheapest ones they had, four ninety nine a box at Academy Sports. Walmart, I still think, was $4.99. That's part of the reason why I picked these things up. Just like pellets, guys, I'm not biased on um, what you know what I shoot out of my gun. I'm going to shoot what shoots best if I can find it and if I can afford it. And I think $4.99 for a box of five was a really, really good deal. Now, again, I think I spent maybe $10 on a 15-pack or $11. Bucks. Um, if I can't find the 15 round packs of uh, rifled slugs, I normally try to pick them up. Um, but a lot of people shoot these. A lot of people like these. Like I said, I have a love-hate relationship with these 20 gauge. If I can find them in 12 gauge for that H&R single shot, you guys know I'm going to pick some up. Try them out of there. Um, right now for the 12 gauge, I'm rocking the Winchester Super X 12 gauge rifled slugs that'll be a video in itself um because that's what i could find with the ammo shortage so y'all just a quick little video an overview of the remington slugger like i said again love hate relationship if you guys like them that's good if you guys shoot them that's good some you would think remington bullets shoot good out of a remington gun no and you know and it could just be like air guns you know the the um, ammo is going to act different out of every single gun, even if it's the same model made out of the same lot. You never know. But uh, 
Y'all, I hope y'all like this little overview of the Remington 20 gauge sluggers. Again, two and three fourths, a five eighths ounce. And this is SP20RS, so I think this came with like one of those. Again, I believe this came out of the um, value pack that I picked up at Walmart quite a bit ago, guys. So, yeah, here's the little sluggers right here, guys. And uh, remember, like, comment, subscribe. Jesus loves you. And I will see you guys on the next one. Thanks for joining me on the Ammo Outline number five.